Hey guys, I actually got a request for some basic uh, scripting knowledge, so I'm going to be making beginner tutorials on how to understand all the script that we're going through or the basic mechanics of how those scripts work and stuff. So in this one I'm going to be going over if, else if, and else statements. So we'll go into our update function. And so pretty much if statements, so it goes in, yeah, this order, if, else if, and else. And you can call them within each other, you can call them in order, or whatever, I'll show you a couple different ways. Also just going to be using a simple uh, variable to go over a couple of other things. So we'll go over variable, and we'll call it my number, and we'll call this an int and we'll just make this uh, zero for now. Okay, so a variable is just like an object you create and my number, so this is where the name, you want the name to go that you reference. And then uh, int is just a whole number, so like zero, one, two, three, four, five. And then a float would be like zero point uh, one or zero point two and they have decimal points, but we're just going to be covering ints in this one. So let's say you are working with a script and you want to check if this number is greater or less than, alright, we'll just change this to 5. So you want to say if my number, and then there's a couple of different symbols we can use we can use greater than, so if this number is bigger than whatever other number or variable we plug into here, it will access this script. So let's say if my number equals equals 5. Since our number is 5, so it checks is my number equal to 5. and it will go into here. So pretty much, yep, you can do something else with this. So if you say something like else if my number equals equals uh, like six, it will call this script instead. And then else is whatever else, just anything else. Um, it doesn't have to do with anything really, it's just if either neither of these get called it will run that script. Now you could also plug it into here like anything that you want so it'll go down the list it'll say if and if you have code in here for like an if statement else if it'll call that stuff and then it'll go outside of here and since it called this one, it won't call that one, and it won't call that one. So it'll jump to what's ever down here. So we could put another, like, if statement down here and call more code. So it's pretty much just like an ordering thing once you get the hang of it. So let's go in here, and let's just say uh, my number plus plus. Okay, so it'll run through the script it'll check, okay, my number is equal to 5, which it currently is equal to 5. If it's equal to 5, we want to add 1 to this, so it'll make it 6. Now there's one other way you could do this, you could do plus equals and just 1. So it'll take this number and add 1 to it, just like that. But if you want to change this number completely, you could say equals 1, and that would change it from 5 to 1. It would just change it all together. Now if you're working with different types of, or more than one uh, int, you could do my second number, name it an int, and equal this to, we'll say 3. So okay, um, so in here we could do something like if my second number equals
equals equals three. And then it'll call this. But you could also, yeah. So yeah, that's the basics of all that. Um, there's a bunch of other stuff we can cover, but I will save that for future tutorials. Um, we can go over more variables that we can use, more stuff we can do with this script, but I'm just going to keep this script around and uh, keep adding to it, and we'll go over everything you need to know about basic programming. So I don't know how many videos this will be, but uh, keep following along and hopefully you guys will learn something new. If you have any questions whatsoever, just uh, leave them in the comments or send me an uh, inbox message and I can go over what we learned in this one, or else uh, stick around and follow the uh, next couple tutorials.